Hello guys, Pearl Hub 2010 with you today, and today I'm going to be showing you another tutorial and command prompt. Today we're going to be showing you how to move one uh, folder or file from one location to the other location. So let's begin. First, go ahead and open up command prompt. All right. So my my default setting is C users and then my username, which is Dima. Yours might be different, so go ahead. We got to locate ourselves to where the file is at. So let's go to uh, let's go to CD. And uh, another step away to get to the desktop is actually the desktop folder, which will be the desktop folder. Okay, so now we're in our desktop. If, if your default directory is C drive, you would just type in CD user, CD Dima, CD desktop. And that will get you to your desktop as well. CLS clears the screen. And uh, if you haven't watched my previous tutorial, I'll just suggest you watch that because that's that deals with browsing uh, directories and folders inside of Command Prompt, which is going to help you a lot in this tutorial. All right, so now that our file, here's our file example, and it's located on our desktop, and we currently are located in our desktop in the Command Prompt window. So let's say we want to move this example, this example folder, to our X folder, which we created in the previous tutorial. Here's the X folder, and it's currently empty. It's located in C forward slash X. So that's what we have to tell us, a command prompt window to do. So here it's showing us that it's viewing at our desktop. Now we've got to give the example. Now we've got to say move example. Notice you don't have to type in the, out the whole entire path because we are already in the specified path of uh, the file location. So we don't have to type in move and then see users Dima desktop all that because we are already in our desktop and it's already viewing at the files here so to make sure you can actually type in dir space forward slash b and it's going to view all of your files and as you can see we don't have to write out the directory because our example is in was one of these files here so that's just another quick tip so let's type in move that's the command for to move stuff example space so it's going to say move this and now we're going to say where do you want us to move it c colon forward slash x press enter as you can see the message below here appears one directories moved and that's basically a successful message that you have successfully uh finished this operation so if we go to start computer local disk c view the folder x our example is in here now let's say you want to move only a file. Let's move this back to the desktop. You would type in, we're currently in our desktop, now we want to enter the, the folder. So CD example. And now we've got to type in DIR forward slash B. Forward slash B doesn't give you, because if you type in just DIR, it gives you the date, the time, and what kind of file this is, and all the file unnecessary information. So DIR forward slash B just gives you the file names. So what we can do is we can type in move and then one of these file names right here m2u I probably should have changed this but dot mpg move that file to cx as you can see it says one file is moved so if we go back to our my computer local disk c folder x we can see that the file has been moved and as so this works not only with folders but with files as well that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment sections below. Rate, comment, subscribe. Peace out.